Yo, know the vibes, DP215, I'm back with another one. I'll show you where I'm coming from. All I do is expose the truth and let it go to the youth. I'm speaking what I feel because I love to keep it real. You understand me? Lil Nas X, what we not about to do, right? We not about to normalize that gay shit. For the simple fact that being gay is not normal. You feel what I'm saying? If you don't know what that means... That means that it was once upon a time that you had, you had to hide it. You had to hide being gay. You had to hide it. You had to stay in the closet. Because niggas will beat your ass. All up and down the streets on some gay shit. Like, nigga, you better chase these girls. Don't be chasing no men. You want men? You want it up your butthole? You little punk? Once upon a time, you got treated like that. Now it's fair game. Now you got a whole community backing you. Got a whole motherfucking thousands and millions of people that cancel you on networks and try to get you banned from certain stations and networks and all this shit like that. You feel me? Got a whole army of these motherfuckers. Well, guess what? I would say it's more straight people out here. I'm willing to go to war. I don't give a fuck. I'm going to speak if the mind, as long as the mind is still working, as I'm alive, as long as I'm alive. I'm going to speak of the mind. And that gay shit, to me, force feeding it through music, we're going to have to prohibit that. We're going to have to go against that. Yeah, we're going to have to go against that. You can take that shit on the other side of the world. But you know where it's predominantly straight people that have a real message. A message that could shift the culture. A message that could teach people. A message that could uplift people. You come out here with some gay shit, man. Kissing men. You know what I'm saying? That that's that's your message. That's the only message you got. Be yourself. Be comfortable in your own skin. Kiss men. Kiss men. Come on, man. That shit gotta stop, man. That shit has to stop, man. Being gay never been cool, man. I don't give a fuck if you a female or a fucking dog. Or a fucking man being gay never been cool. Never been cool. But like I said, Obama passed the rule for you motherfuckers. So now you can go ahead and go on, on your little rants any chance you get. And you're so sensitive every time somebody say something. But y'all motherfuckers is weird. Y'all the weird ones. Straight people can't figure out why gay people do what they do. And gay people can't figure out why straight people do why, what straight people do. It's a war going on outside. It's deeper than what you think. It's an acceptance war. Everybody wants to be accepted. An acceptance war. You feel me? Well, guess what? Gay shit is something I will never accept. I don't care what the circumstances is. Who it is. Where it is. Gay shit... I will never accept. I don't have to accept it. You're gay. Will you accept straight shit? No, because you're gay. Y'all need to hear this shit. I don't give a fuck who he is. What opportunities on the table? You feel what I'm saying? We're going to change the narrative. And we're going to stand up. I am. I am. I'm going to be the first to say it. I don't give a fuck what who feel or how who feel. Stop that fucking gay shit, man. Stop it. Well, if you're going to do the gay shit, do the gay shit on your own time, in your own... The more you publicize it, the more gay people is going to come out. Because these people, there's going to be people trying that shit, man. Give these kids a chance. If a person is grown and they gay, ain't no turning back. But if you keep forcing this gay shit out here, these kids is picking that shit up, man. I'm glad I was raised right. Signing off, man. You know the fucking vibes, DB215. Like it or love it. Or think nothing of it.